this. <sighs> this is how many more days left of school there are in my life. So today marks the start of the final week of my life being a full-time student with a full-time job and I'm so ready for it to be over. My game plan for today is to start my analysis paper. It's supposed to be 10 to 15 pages. We have like a group report that we have to submit. So I think I'm gonna get a rough draft going on that, share it with my teammates. I think I'll start working on my English homework because I do have about 13 assignments to do for that class this week. Um, yeah, here we go. It's time to get started. As you can see, there's the first page and there's another whole page and now it's time to move on to the next assignment after maybe I'm gonna get some coffee got my coffee and a bagel and here's my itinerary so far and this is what's on schedule for the week so as you can see I have a lot of work to do. So what I like to do is go to the coffee shop because it's quiet or like it's loud but like it's quiet enough to get reading done but I won't fall asleep and that is my problem. Every time I have to read anything I just fall asleep because I'm so uninterested. But it's not, it's not like it's boring stuff. It's like I just can't focus on it. Like it just makes me sleepy and tired. So this is how I have to do it. Got a ton of work done and then picked up some Chick fil A for dinner. Today was a pretty long day. I did a bunch of homework all day. I got the rough draft done for our group project, like a quarter of my case analysis. I did the first two assignments out of 13 for my English class. I really wanted to take the final exam today, but I didn't. Today is Tuesday, and since I didn't go to work yesterday, this is basically a Monday for me, and I'm really excited about that. sun is basically down but what can you do you know this is just how it goes when you work full-time and you go to school full-time and I am going home to pick up my backpack and then I'm gonna go to the coffee shop and get some homework done so I spent a couple hours at the coffee shop and then I came home and decided to get some exercise so I walked a mile to the taco truck now I'm on my way back and then it's dinner time those tacos were amazing now i get to do the assignment i've been looking forward to which is i get to watch a movie Today goes by really quick. I need to run a lot of errands tonight. After work, I don't have time to go straight to the coffee shop to do homework. So it's gonna be a busy day. So despite the fact that I live within such a close radius of my new job, um, it's only like three or four miles. It still takes me like 45 minutes to get home. It's out of control. After work, 
I went to Literati again. I've literally been there every day for the last like two weeks after work or even on the weekends to get my work done because if I do it here, it just doesn't really get done. Four more days. I made it through Thursday, so now tomorrow is Friday. Tonight I'm gonna take my BSG final, then I'm going to watch a film, write the paper that goes with it, and then I'm going to the laundromat. I just realized I forgot to eat dinner, so. No, thank you. going to in and out around 11:30 last night. I couldn't sleep after that. So, I woke up, you know, I don't know, half an hour, 45 minutes ago. It's finally the weekend. I'm on my way to the coffee shop right now to get some work done and then I'm going to go home, probably do a little bit more work and then sleep in tomorrow because an average four hours a night. I could really use a full night's sleep. So I slept for a very long time last night. 10 solid hours. Today's big day, but I do have the whole thing to work on homework, so guess what I'm going to be doing? Exactly that. I'm exhausted. Going for a run this morning was so nice. I'm going to take a really quick shower, do my makeup, and head out to the coffee shop again. I have like a paper for one of my finals, um, and it just has to be 750 words. And then I have to finish my Walmart analysis paper, which is supposed to be about 10 pages, and all I've written is one, so definitely really have to do some work on that today. English class, I have still to watch that one other movie. If there's a paper that I have to write about it, that'll be probably a page single-spaced, maybe two. I have to read these two like short stories. They're like 20 pages a piece. It's gonna be a busy weekend, but it's really nice knowing that after tomorrow, it's over. <laughs> Despite the fact that I spent a few hours at the coffee shop, I didn't feel like I got much done. Um, all I had a chance to do was do a final edit of what my group did with my uh, BSG report paper. And um, I basically finished the final for that class as well, because there were two finals. One was like a multiple choice test, and then the other part of the final was a paper that we have to write on a merger and acquisition that's going on in the marketplace. Why is it always so difficult to finish these friggin' things? It's supposed to be 750 words. It's 628.
this is it, my final day. I'm going to the cafe to finish up my 10 page paper and then I will come home and finish the other two page papers I have left. And then I will be done. My teacher gave us an extension on these two assignments, number 10 and 14, because apparently nobody has uh, turned them in. <laughs> so all I have left to do tonight is just that freaking long paper, and I have an hour and a half to do it. I've been wearing the last chain from that thing on my wrist. It's like at midnight I'm going to get to tear it off and like break out of this jail. Last night was a bit of a roller coaster. I had finished all of the work, sort of. My 10 page paper wasn't quite 10 pages, but it was, it was, it was right there. The slot to submit my assignment closed at 11.59 and I didn't log in to submit my assignment until 11.59, so I was stupid. And uh, my teacher explicitly told us this week he does not accept papers through email, so I tried emailing it to him in hopes that like maybe I'd get some credit and this morning he emailed me back and he said I reopened it so you could submit it so I'm gonna pass both my classes and and I'm no longer a full-time student.